Well, as we have been talking about now, uh, yesterday's shuttle flyover was just simply spectacular. If you were watching Fox 5 special coverage, you know we were able to share some great images of uh, basically the entire flyover thanks to Sky Fox. Joining us now is Sky Fox photographer Jeremiah Haas uh, on duty this morning as well. Good morning, sir. How are you? Pretty good. How are you guys doing this morning? Good. We're doing great. First of all, uh, the pictures you provided yesterday, spectacular, wonderful, and, and thank you for the hard work you did and that you do every day. Tell us your thoughts. What was it like up there seeing it? I'm still surprised that they're able to fly with a shuttle piggyback on top of the 747. And uh, it was just, uh, I'm really glad I was able to bring all the shots back for everybody to see, and I'm, I'm really glad you guys liked it. Jeremiah, you know, I talked to a photographer as I was leaving, and he said, I wish I had just put the camera down and watched it for a second just for me. Do you think you got a chance to actually be just a regular guy just for a second to see what was going on, or were you a photographer the whole time? I basically had to be a photographer the whole time. Uh, we were actually just talking about that very same thing this morning, how nice it would have been to maybe just be on the ground and experience it. Because you almost have to be a little detached from what's going on and to make sure that you cover everything for the people at home. Have you, have you had a chance to really look at your work today, look at some of the uh, recordings from yesterday? Because Tony's right, it was just fabulous. Well, I thank you very much for that. I'm glad everyone liked it. <laughs> I did the best I could. <laughs> Hey, Jeremiah, l let me ask a question, uh, just from a technical standpoint, because you, you, were, you were on it all morning, how, how close were you able to get to the plane? I know you have zoom lenses and everything, but how close were you able to get? The closest we were able to get when it was doing the flyby in, in Gulf, and we were more than maybe a half a mile or closer away from it. And the furthest away it was was maybe like 10 miles, and it was just a little speck in the camera, and it was all I could do not to lose it. I couldn't see it with my eyeball just looking out the window. Hmm. Wow. So you, you're just tracking it just like we are waiting to see it because our pictures, thanks to you and we had also NASA television as well, we never lost sight of it um, except for the moments that it was just making its way here from Florida. So you basically also had to, to know where it was in the sky. Yeah, I mean, you had to be aware of where it was at all times. You know, I wanted to make sure there was always a picture for you guys to go to so everybody could see it. And, uh, you know, sometimes when it was really close, it was easy to do. And when it was far away, it, it got pretty challenging. Well, Jeremiah, uh, uh, I, I just want to pass on from our viewers. Uh, I got a lot of comments yesterday. I know people have written into uh, 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 our uh, Facebook page and all that kind of stuff. Work, a job well done, and, uh, and again, like I said, uh, we thank you for what you do every day. It's very hard work and dangerous work, and we appreciate it. All right, thank you very much. And thanks to uh, the pilot yesterday, Bobby Ratliff, as well. Mm -hmm. All right, be safe up there. Yeah, good stuff. Mm -hmm. It is now 721 on this Wednesday morning. Are you looking for a job? Well, the list of the fastest growing industries is out. You just might be surprised by some that made the list. And Kermit the Frog, Hi, Kermit. Aww. Dorothy's Ruby Slippers, baseballs used by Babe Ruth, all things that you can view at a new Smithsonian exhibit. And our Holly Morris takes us back in time to explore the great American stories of these treasured artifacts. We're going to be right back. We'll check in with her a little later at 722. Tommy is ageless. Mm -hmm.